Hello, YouTube friends and family. RV Debs here with you. And I am very pleased to say that I actually painted a painting today. Finally, I uh, got my lazy butt to pull out the paints. And this is, I'll tell you, I, I it's sloppy. It's just a messy thing. Here's, <laughs> here's my two palettes. I have to wash the brushes. Here's all the brushes and it's dirty water. But I think you're going to like my painting. At least I really am happy with it. Um, and this is it. I'm calling it Calgary. And yes, it does remind me of Texas. Um, my first time ever painting this type of painting. But it's basically my normal. I mean, I love the bright colors. And I... Um, I thought the cross was was good. It's what it just that's I try to figure out what am I going to paint because I'm kind of a moody, moody artist, moody painter, um, and I know somebody wants me to make a cat. Not I eventually will, but I really just didn't. All I could think of was something with a cross. It's not perfect. I mean, I'm looking at it. It's not perfect, but that's just you know it comes out of me this way. I mean, I could pick it apart. <laughs> Never done, right? Anyway, it's 8 by 10 I listed it on Etsy. I'm going to try to paint a bunch of paintings so that I can make extra money so I can go to Colorado for a few days and not feel broke. Yes. I also want to tell you guys, um, from my, yes, my, um, my last video, that I was kind of bummed out and feeling kind of depressed a little bit. And that's part of me. I, I don't always feel that way. I'm not feeling that way at all today. As a matter of fact, the painting made me feel better. I want to tell you that none of you hurt my feelings. And, um, you know, I know that when, when you take the time to type a message to me, a comment, that you're actually taking time in your life to share something that you want to tell me. And some of you would like to tell me what I should do. Um, and that's that's okay. Because everybody has ideas and, and information that they want to share and what they think is best. Truthfully, I I I know what I I know what I need to do most of the time. And even though some of the comments say things that I would never be interested in. Um, there's just, I mean, I'm just not interested. I'm not interested in donating my time to, to uh, nursing homes or the aging center. I go to the center to enjoy myself, to get to know people, not to have pressure to teach something to them. They don't need me to teach anything anyway. Um, but anyway, that's the truth. And the reason I even go to the center was uh, that one of the ladies that run the center is in my Bible study class. And she is the one that pretty much invited me and got me going. So she knows what I do. And I just really am very pleased that I've made myself go because they are older than me, most of the people. Although the lady that runs the center is in her 50s. This weekend, um, Saturday night, we're doing Pioneer Woman recipes. And that's going to be really good. I am not going to eat bread or potatoes and stuff. Although, I probably will have a little something because I'm not going to lie. I don't lie. I don't like to lie. I'm go Everybody's supposed to pick something from Pioneer uh, I am going to make a legal keto meal, uh, part of the meal. I'm going to make poppers, and I'm going to make the poppers a little different than normal. Uh, I, I looked up Pioneer Woman, and she makes the poppers with cream cheese, cheddar cheese, and green onions all mixed together, and then she stuffs the jalapeno halves and wraps them in bacon, I'm going to use regular bacon and turkey bacon because some of the people in the family don't eat um, pork. So I'll have two kinds. 
And I'm also going to make for the kids. I saw the Pioneer Woman make, you know how Rice Krispie treats are with marshmallow. Well, I'm going to make my Rice Krispie treats, but I'm going to use Fruit Loops with marshmallows and multicolored marshmallows and drizzle white chocolate on top. Yeah, that's a danger. But the kids are going to love it and I'm going to try it. So I will, hopefully, I will video the things I'm making. I've got to make myself, bring my camera, bring my, my phone over to when I cook. Sometimes I'll cook something and the next thing I know I go, oh, I forgot to video. But I am going to do it. And I was uh, contacted by a company who would like me to use either kitchen utensils and see if I like them and show them on two medias. So probably like Instagram and uh, YouTube. Also, um, I can't remember the name of it. I, I, when I get the information, I'll share it. But it's uh, a company that sends meat. Uh, chicken and meat and all kinds of beef, like 40 pounds. And that would be super because I can share it with the family <coughs> and uh, videotape some of the recipes that we make out of them and tell you all where I got them. But I don't even know yet about the uh, particulars. But it's interesting, isn't it? And why not, you know? Why not? I'll be honest. So that's what's going on here. I'm feeling a lot more energetic today, a lot better today. And at uh, 7 o'clock tonight, there's a baseball game with the kids. Uh, Chase's catcher. I'm going to go to that. <clears throat> and that's about it for me. Uh, as far as what I do, usually in the evenings, uh, I, I, I either play games. Last night I played Triominoes at Cat and Mark's house. Came back here and I, I watch uh, a DVR Survivor. The Voice. These are the things I enjoy. Survivor, The Voice, Dancing with the Stars. Um, when The Bachelorette comes, I'll watch that. I like the show Botched. That's kind of interesting on uh, Plastic Surgeons. These guys fix other people's mistakes. <clears throat> and I'm also into, I think it's called, and one called Cooper's Treasure. Now, if you haven't checked out Cooper's Treasure, it's really good. It's um, this guy who grew up during the 60s with this astronaut who was uh, one of the astronauts that circled the uh, Earth several times and took pictures. And he took pictures and saw, like he knew where the Atosha was before they even, uh, the treasure hunters got Mel, Mel uh, whatever his name is. Anyway. So he, uh, this man who's friends with him, is um, going to get a treasure that's come from these space shots. Anyway, it's real interesting. It's called Cooper's Treasure. That's it for me today. I think I've just about said enough, don't you think? Have a beautiful afternoon and evening, and I'll talk with you soon. Peace out. Go, angels! Oh. oh, catch it, catch it. Oh, no. That's the problem. <laughs> don't, you don't want to throw it. That's Chase right there, the catcher. What did you do for fun today? Not much. Not much. The gang is all here. Hello, everybody. Hey, Hello. 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 Hey, Chase. Yeah. Good job. I guess, I guess that the, you, they were going to go for a trial for a moment. Well, the angels are the ones in the field right now. That's our team, and that's Chase. He's the catcher. Let's see how he does here. Foul ball. That's our team. They're up. They're they're hitting. Six. 
It's a pretty day. Nice clear skies. It's very cool. Nice. Very comfy. Xavier, sit down and pay attention. <clears throat> Tanny. They they do have now. They do have a now. But before, when my school, we had the four grades. Go go go! Run 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 run! Safe! Yay! I'm terrible. Don't bring me somewhere. I get into it. All right, Chase is going to put it out of the park this time. Just Chase, oh yeah. I thought he jumped over it, but he didn't, right? He tagged it. Oh, I thought he jumped over it. No, the bag. <laughs> okay, Chase is up next. You're going to hit that, aren't you? What's, the, what's his batter's name? That's our boy. Hunter, okay. Yeah. Is it, who is he? We know who he is. Who's this kid? Hey, stay right there. Now this is Chase. He's up. That's our baby. All right, Bubba, come on, baby. Let's go, Bubba. Yeah. Knock it to the fence back there. Hit it good. <laughs> okay, Chase, get one for me. You can do it. Yeah, it seems like he's got the bat in a weird position. Hey, you. <laughs> You go! Run, 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 run! Run! run. Oh. <coughs> Good hustle. Hey. The family. Xavier! <laughs> Oh yeah. Well, we won the ball game. The boys won the ball game. <laughs> Maybe their team is the Angels, and they are. And now we're here. We're gonna have a little fire for the sunset. Chickens are having some food. Cat coming out. Oh yeah, this is life in a little town in Texas. Not too shabby. The garden's being watered. Chickens are fed. <laughs> nice. Very peaceful. She's in her wheelchair because she likes to wheel around. Well, I like sitting in it. I know you do. You have one chair? I got one. Starving. Still hungry. Yeah. Well, and eat. What a pretty night.
don't know who that was. Who are you waving at? I'll tell you, I'll tell you what a pallet's good for. In the winter time, I'll set a whole pallet in there first. Yeah. The logs on it, man, you have a, a fire twice that height. Rip roaring fire. Yeah. Yeah, what else are the pallets for? Whatever you want. <laughs> Whatever we decide. I called the fire department to tell them we have a controlled burn here. And they said okay? Yeah. Because it's not a fire being in here. Someone take the camera apart. Ah, yes. It's been a nice day. I must tell you. Look at the tree, finally. Lots of leaves. This is a pecan tree. Well, here we are at the end of the day. I just want to thank you for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Just going to sit out here for a while, enjoy the fire. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I hope you do. I pretty much have a regular vlog here. And I have had it for the last, what, two years? This month is two years. Pretty exciting. Love you all. Peace out, my friends. Talk to you soon.